<laughs> Alright, just came from uh, the movie theater. I want to go see Ghostbusters Afterlife. So, I'm not going to I'm going to tell you anything and everything about the movie because... Hey, I'm in my truck. I drove a bobtail to the movie theater. I'm going to tell you because um, this thing got a, uh, a bad review. So, nobody really wants to see it. So, I don't care. So, I'm going to tell you about it. That was a ghost. Maybe not. <clears throat> All right. It brought tears to my eyes. Um. So this came out like in November 19 or something, November 22nd. I already saw the reviews on YouTube and I saw the, I already knew what was gonna happen. How it was gonna end. They even got two post credit scenes, which I saw the, you know, they talked about it and explained it. But um, it's not about knowing the ending, it's about getting to the ending. How did they get there? I even shed a couple of tears. Harold Ramis is dead. Rest in peace. Ivan Reitman was the director and screenplay. I think he might have passed, but Jason, Jason Reitman is the one who directed it, produced it, and I think wrote it. It was his father's work, so his son took over. And there was real beef with the actual actors. I can't remember if it was Harold Ramis and Bill Murray, or, ah, uh, Ray, what's that guy's name? Uh, anyway, the movie brought back memories. I enjoyed it. Even though it was cheesy, I enjoyed it. And then Ant-Man was in it. <laughs> Ant-Man, right? Of all people, Paul Rudd. Um, this is why I hate trying to remember things. Because I never, I, while I'm watching it, it's like, oh, I want to tell you that and I want to tell you this. Um, they did CGI work with Harold Ramis. And, um, it was kind of cheesy. I think they said they had like a body double that had the same facial features. And then they kind of um, pasted Harold Ramis' face on it. He didn't talk. It was very touching. Um, the lady who played Gozer, I know it's not the same lady because she's older, but it looked like the same lady. Body type, face, everything. Um, a part of the movie, Paul Rudd acted just like Rick Moranis. Rick Moranis, that's my boy right there. I like him. Um, I like the movie. What can I say? If they ever come out with a DVD set, I'm buying it. We might not ever play DVDs again. But I'm going to buy it. Ghostbusters Afterlife. The one with the ladies, that was dumb. That was dumb. But this one, yeah, I think Sigourney, Sigourney Weaver played in this. I think that was Sigourney Weaver in the movie, in the post credit scene. Sigourney Weaver? I don't know. But um, that's all I wanted to say. I enjoyed the movie. I enjoyed the movie. <laughs> the girl, you know, what do you call a fish with no eye? You know, why, why were you not trusting Adam? Because Adam made up everything. <laughs> Dad jokes, right? It's just so stupid. Anyway. Alright. I gotta go get I gotta go teach my kids how to ride drive. Peace out.